my friends, doTERRA builders and leaders. The sales guide is so masterfully put together, it can be a great tool to really just add some massive momentum and growth to your doTERRA business. So you've now seen all the different sections of the sales guide. If you go to the very back two pages, we pull everything together and there's an assessment. So as you look at this, you can see that it's titled Unlock Your Potential and it invites you to tally your sales score. And then you see listed there every single category that we just went through, okay? Starting on page nine, all the way through to page 21 all of the different skill sets that are involved to really improve your ability to go out and effectively share the product, right? So what's really important about this is that they should be able to, you or your new builder, new team member, new leader, should be able to go back and look at the prior pages and take your score, transfer it to this one sheet so that you can tally it all up and get your overall assessment, your total sales score. Now, what I love about this is this is totally yours, right? It's not getting posted on doTERRA's website, as fun as that would be. Um, we're not doing that. This is totally yours for your own self-development, self-improvement, and for you to see where you are now and in 90 days and in 120 days, so on and so forth, actually it'd be great to do this at least three or four times a year to really see your improvement and allows you to identify where to focus. Now in doTERRA, we talk a lot about your strengths, focusing on your strengths and how if you invest in your strengths, then you just are going to not only love it, you're going to be more productive, you're going to be happier, you're going to have even better results. And those things are all true. But we don't want to neglect entirely those areas where maybe there needs to be a little TLC, right? A little bit of practice to strengthen those areas. And so on this back page where it says plan and track your success, you have a couple boxes there that invite you to record your score, write down the skill set that you're needing to focus on, and then what specific action will you take to improve? When will you take this action? How will you know? when you have improved and think about those questions. And if you aren't quite sure, what should I do? What do I do to practice closing or to get better at closing? Go back to that section in the book and every single skill set has a box with a segment of recommended suggestions that you can focus on to improve that skill set. You have 10 sections to choose from. Identify two of those that you want to have greater improvement in. Put those on the right side of the paper, right? Write down what you're gonna do and then make that your homework. Once you've identified the two sales skill sets you're gonna focus on, then look at the goal section on the very bottom. And now you all know why goals are so important. This is something we talk about a lot. I'm not always a super huge fan of New Year's resolutions because they usually are dead by February, right? And we've all experienced that. And part of the reason that happens is because we, we set a goal and we go way far out and we don't break it up into smaller pieces. So what's really important and helps to be effective is to break it up. So you see here that you have a 30-day goal. Okay, 30-day goals are small, manageable, bite-sized amount of time that we can focus on. What's our 30-day goal? Then the 30-day goal is gonna take you to the 90-day goal and then eventually to your one-year goal and beyond. So this is for your sales goals. And I would encourage you first and foremost if you as a current doTERRA builder or leader have not personally gone through this material, I please, I invite you to do so. Um, it will only help hone your skills and make you better at what you love to do. And for those of us that have done this or once you've done this, then I would invite you to sit down with the people that are actively building and go through this with them or even those that are just getting started and wanting to know how they can accelerate faster and grow faster, then sit down and go through the sales guide with them, tally their score, follow up a few months later, and watch their progress, and use this as a tool to create massive momentum in your business.